Well, this is the address in the emails. It's not so late to turn around. Nope. I uh, haven't seen my mom in five years. I want some answers. Let's get you some answers. I also really have to pee. Um, what, not Tagana? Yet, but... Oh, she's been meaning to, and then she remembered she's in high school. Uh, uh -huh. Um, <laughs> let's not talk about high school. That's boring. I still can't believe you ended up with Andrew Spencer. Remember when he used to chase you around on his scooter? Oh, and he had the chunkiest cheeks. I don't know why I thought it would be different. You take me home. Okay. Some strawberry tarts coming in hot for my strawberry tart. Aw, thanks, babe. For the pastry is not that weird nickname. I know waiting can be stressful, but I also know morning pastries can relax you, so be calm. Uh Great party, babe. People are already saying this was the rager of the year. Do you need anything else? Water, soda, chips, dip, and okay, Andrew, chips. Andrew, <laughs> Andrew, Andrew, Andrew. I know that you're worried about me, but I am trying to have fun. And you following me around and making sure I'm okay is actually really unnerving. Huh. <laughs> okay. There you are. I've been looking for you. Chris P and Christy T just did a three-way makeup session with Christine C. This is the rager <laughs> of the year. <laughs> Are you having fun? Oh, yeah, I'm having so much fun. I'm also so, so sad. <laughs> Sorry. Are you in, Are you in dress? Oh. I am just feeling my feelings <laughs> in a very feeling-y way. Mm, so that's a yes. <laughs> I am trying to be strong and positive for you because I know the last thing you need is another person to take care of. But the truth is, I am so scared. Waiting for your dad to tell us about you moving, it's killing me. And I know high school romances are usually just whatever. Everyone thinks that they have an expiration date. I feel like you and I are different. I think we are bigger than that. I know we are. I know we are, too. And I'm scared, too. <laughs> um, I'm just trying to live in the moment. Well done, Mia Brooks. This is a killer party. Your dad will be none the wiser. You are a legend in your own time. Hey, Andrew. Stop that crying. Yeah, I know this party was your fault. No, right. <laughs> <laughs> Through critically acclaimed dark Danish dramas about three times now, maybe we pick something. Um, yeah. See, that, yeah, sounds like we're gonna press play and then pause it 10 seconds later because you wanna talk. I was just, I thought I would hear from Lake. But I guess she's busy with Lucy. Well, what's going on with you? Are you jealous of Lucy? No. They've just gotten so close so fast. You know, when, when, when she was dating Felix, she needed a girlfriend to talk about him. But with Lucy, her girlfriend is a girlfriend to talk to you about her girlfriend. Let's just watch a movie. Let's just, we've been best friends since fourth grade. 
You're wearing my face mask. Well, I thought maybe that I could fill in for Lake, be your girlfriend for tonight. Oh, well, that's the sweetest thing any girlfriend has ever done for me. Mm -hmm. It's like, uh, I could ignore it. No, take I, it. I am going to focus on my shrinking pores. Be there. Yeah, you know, I, I booked my ticket already and everything, and now I'm, I'm just gonna miss the whole thing. Right, so you'll miss the birth. What's important is you're gonna be a big sister. There was something wrong? I don't think that anything is wrong. Yeah, probably right. Yeah. I just can't believe I'm missing this. Uh-oh, you're under Lake's weighted blanket cuddling uh, Creepy doll. Mm -mm. I knitted it for the baby. Mm. Well, come on. I got a surprise for you. Okay. <laughs> okay. It'll be worth it, I promise. Hi. Hey, honey. Oh, my God. Hey, listen. How did you do this? I called the hospital and used my undeniable charm to convince a lovely nurse named Diane to bring in an iPad. He Venmoed her a hundred bucks. Yeah, that's charming in its own way. Thank you. Okay, we can all agree that this is... Look, I, uh, I just happened to overhear you on the phone with your coach. Sounds like you skipped out on a big opportunity to be here. Yeah, I missed a game while we were traveling. And there were recruiters from Northwestern at it. Mia didn't understand how important that would be for you. Actually, I didn't tell her. I look, Andrew. I love how devoted you are to my daughter. I just, I just want to make sure that devotion doesn't get in the way of your future. You know, Mia wouldn't want that. Me is my future. Everything else comes second. All right, welcome everyone. He has said the name Zahara maybe 500 times in the past five minutes. <laughs> I Andrew, I want it you first. <laughs> there was a recruiter from Northwestern at the game I missed. Why did nobody tell you in advance? They did, but I wanted to be here with you. Andrew. No, don't Andrew me. Nothing is more important to me than being there for you. I don't like keeping things from you, so I just wanted to tell you. All right, your turn. What did you want to talk about? I just wanted to thank you. Uh, you've, you've been incredible these last few months. <laughs> hey, you. Hey. I can't wait for this winter carnival. I am going to win you a goldfish that is most definitely going to die by the end of the night. Andrew. I need to tell you, I'm moving to Palo Alto. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I, I know it's not uh, what we planned, but I realize that I need to uh, be with my family. No, I, we can figure this out. Um, we can make it work. I will just skip some school, help you get situated, and then we can just kind of... No, I don't want you to miss any school. Okay, then I'll come out on weekends. Just take the red eye on Friday, and then the last flight out Andrew, on Sunday. Andrew, no, no, I... You have basketball on the weekend. So I can miss some games. I don't okay. want you to miss them. Basketball is your future. Mia, you are my future. Uh, you don't know that. But I can't, I can't, I can't have you just like throwing away everything that you, that you worked for. What is this? What are you doing right now? Are you breaking up with me? 
just, I don't know. I don't know what else to do. I guess fighting for us is off the table. Andrew. Screw this. Of course, I think we're worth fighting for. Andrew, I love you more than anything in the world. I just panicked because long distance is really, really hard. And uh, I got scared that you would get tired of it and break my heart. But I'm not scared anymore. Well, actually, no, I'm, I'm terrified. <laughs> uh, but I'm embracing the scary. There's nothing to be scared of. We are going to be fine. How do you know that? I know it. You and I are going the distance. Give me a Brooks. Deal with it. What's wrong with you? I'm, I'm okay. I'm really sorry. All right.